Hey everyone, this is Aaron with Front Row Negative, back with another unboxing. This time it is the, I guess, Endgame Marvel Collector Squirt box. Um, it just arrived not too long ago. Uh, pretty much these, are, these come, like I think, every two or three months. You get one of these boxes. Uh, this one is Endgame. The one before that was uh, Captain Marvel, I think. Um, but this is came. I know they wanted to release this after the movie. That way, no spoilers. But uh, I guess let's dive right in. Since you can't really see what's that, it's Marvel. Got the knife. Okay, that was a bag. There we go. Better cut. And you know what's in a box? Another box. So, here you go Avengers Endgame. I finally saw the movie about two weeks after it came out due to, um, well, just life getting in the way kids, work, marriage. Yeah, so let's see what's in this. But the movie was really good. I really enjoyed it. Thought it was great for three hours. Oh, something fell out. Uh, and it tells you what the next box is, and it looks like it's Spider-Man: Far From Home, which is really cool. Uh, big Spider-Man fan, so uh, definitely will be getting that one. Continuing my service. So I see. First thing first is. There is a shirt. There is... Okay. Um, let's see what shirt it is. Y'all get to see it first. What does it look like? Alright, and we got a... Okay, we got the, the Thor Bites shirt. With chicken leg, pizza, and milk. That's kind of cool. That is kind of cool. Uh, this was a surprise in the movie. Uh, I, I enjoyed it heavily. I thought it was pretty funny. Um, I like the design. I like the simple use of colors. Uh, the, and, oh, look, it's even got like a McDonald's-esque hamburger box at the bottom. Uh, looking at it right now, the only thing I would add, just to kind of really send it home the point for that scene, is if he was wearing, uh, like a, a gaming system headset, microphone and a headphone, and there's a controller next to his uh, next to his hand. Uh, that would have been pretty cool. Or a beer, but I don't know Funko. I don't think they want they're too heavy on the beer or alcoholic uh, propaganda. So that's why he's drinking milk, I guess, instead of a uh, beer or ale or mead. But oh well, uh, that's a pretty cool shirt. Definitely dig that. Definitely like that. Next up, we have. <clears throat> I think this is the pop that leaked, or people are excited about the most. So remember, so a few friends were talking about it. You have the Captain America with the with Mjolnir. Uh, pivotal scene in the movie. Very enjoyable. I remember when this happened, people were clapping and they're all excited because of this. Um, very cool. So the, I will definitely be keeping this one. Usually when these pops, I do trades or do everything else to get the ones I want. But I like this one. This is really cool. So I will be keeping this pop. Okay, next up we got uh, Valkyrie. Um... I mean, she's holding a sword and her, her hair is blowing in the wind along with her cape. Which, again, that's kind of cool, but uh, I don't know. Not really a big Valkyrie fan, so uh, she'll probably go up for trade. So that's kind of interesting. Next up, it looks like we have, uh, what are these? Coaster set. These are in-game rubber coaster set. Let's see what we got. We have Iron Man and we have Thanos. Okay, um, these are pretty cool. I might just cut these up and put them in my car. Uh, it's like the, the drink coasters in the bottom of the car. Um, cool, uh, I guess. And actually, that's really it. Uh, a shirt, two pops. Oh, this one's kind of damaged. Let's see right there. Kind of bent in, we're kind of damaged. Uh, I mean, that's cool, but for the price you're paying, that seems, uh, you know, not fulfilling. Uh, for the other pop, I, you know, we could have got, you know, Tony snapping with the gaunt with his own gauntlet, or we could have got, uh, you know, just something 
more than, than Valkyrie. Uh, I think this didn't really, I don't know. I don't think, I don't think this was great. It could have been better. I mean, this is great because this fits, this is a pivotal scene and this does feel like an exclusive through Funko. This one bent too? No, it's not. Um, but this one just seems like this was already in the line. They took it out just to throw it in this box and put a MCC sticker on it right there. Uh, but I don't know. I think uh, since it being Tony's last movie, spoiler, that we would have got a pop of him snapping or even like a, like a memorial Tony pop or something. I think the Valkyrie seems a little bit lazy. The Thor shirt is pretty cool. Uh, um, definitely dig that. Coasters are okay. Uh, didn't ask for them, but I'll use them. So, uh, cool. But, uh, yeah, um, for it being the end game box, uh, it kind of feels kind of let down-ish. I mean, you've got two cool things, but this just, I don't know. Uh, I feel a little bit, a little bit left down, but oh well. Uh, so hopefully the Spider-Man one's gonna be much better. Uh, we'll see. Uh, but who knows? Well, again, this is Aaron, front row negative. Click the links and stuff below the description. Do all that jazz. Read it out. Uh, subscribe if you like unboxing videos. Uh, I try to give the honest opinion uh, and stay positive as much as I can, uh, even when you get bad decisions. But uh, until next time, I'm Aaron.